Jigawa State Command of the Nigeria Police Force, NPF in a news statement few minutes ago says the death toll has increased to 170 in the Tuesday night tanker explosion in Tora local government area of the state, adding 70 other victims are still receiving treatment at various hospitals in the state. The death toll rose to 170, 170. At the federal medical centers in Azare, Nguru, and Banin Kudu, 70, 70 people were receiving intensive care. Other hospitals where injured people are being treated include Hadejian General Hospital, Rashid Shekoni Teaching Hospital, Aminu Kano Teaching Hospital, and Dala Orthopedic, the public relations unit of the police command stated. The command had reported that a tragic and devastating incident occurred on October 15, 2024, at about 22.30 hours, involving a petrol tanker with registration number KMC 6412F, driven by one Yusuf Maud, Mel, aged 32 years of Hotoro Quarters, Kano State. The tanker was traveling from Kano to Uguru, Yobe State, when the driver lost control near Khadija University in Maja Town, Tora local government area, causing it to overturn and spill fuel. The patrol entered through the drainage to the outskirts of the village. Unfortunately, villagers attempted to scoop patrol from the drainage, resulting in a flame that engulfed the area and many people were reportedly perished. Area Commander Ringim, Divisional Police Officer Bujungu and their men swiftly raced to the scene. 105, 105, corpses have been evacuated while 50 injured persons were rushed to Ringim and Hadejian General Hospitals for medical attention. The fire was successfully extinguished through the combined efforts of police officers, firefighters, and good Samaritans. The Commissioner of Police for Jigawa State, CPAT Abdullahi, has expressed his condolences to the people of Maja Town and the state as a whole, and he prays that the departed souls rest in perfect peace. Additionally, he prayed to the Almighty Allah to prevent such an incident from happening in the near future. The CP therefore, cautions the well-meaning citizens of the state to stay away from the area where gas tankers have fallen due to the potential hazards related to petroleum products. DSP Lawan Shiaisu Adam, Police Public Relations Officer, Jigawa State Police Command said. Meanwhile, Mourners on Wednesday gathered to bury the victims who died after a fuel tanker exploded in northern Nigeria's Jigawa state. Senator Babangida Husaini representing Jigawa Northwest Senatorial District in the National Assembly in a statement said, Yesterday, I visited Majia Town in Jigawa state to extend my condolences to over 100 families who tragically lost loved ones in the tanker explosion in Tora local government. This heartbreaking incident has left an indelible mark on the community, and my thoughts and prayers are with the grieving families during this difficult time. Along with my condolences, I have contributed 10 million naira to assist the surviving victims who are currently receiving treatment in hospitals across the state. I also visited the Jigawa State Government House to extend my condolences to the Governor of Jigawa State. His Excellency Umar Namadi and Moy. We discussed the ongoing efforts to provide relief and assistance to the affected families and survivors. In the face of this tragedy, we stand united. I will continue to collaborate with the relevant authorities to ensure that those affected receive the necessary support. May Allah SWT grant the deceased eternal rest and the survivors a quick recovery. Nigerian Medical Association, NMA Jigawa State Chapter in a statement on Friday said, At this trying moment, the NMA Jigawa State wishes to extend its profound gratitude and heartfelt commendation to the dedicated doctors and healthcare workers who are tirelessly managing our born patients following the tragic petrol tanker explosion in Magia Town. The incident has led to severe casualties, and despite being overwhelmed, our doctors in general hospitals Ringim, Hadejia, Rashid Shekoni Federal University Teaching Hospital Dutse, Federal Medical Centers Benenkudu and Uguru, 
Aminu Kano Teaching Hospital, AKTH, and the Orthopedics Hospital Dala have stepped up in this time of crisis to provide critical care to the victims. We salute the courage, resilience, and commitment of all the medical professionals on the front lines. Your tireless efforts, even in the face of overwhelming patient loads and limited resources, have not gone unnoticed. You continue to embody the true spirit of the medical profession, saving lives, easing suffering, and providing hope in the most challenging of circumstances. The NMA Jigawa urges health personnel, regardless of their duty schedule, to lend a hand in this critical period. Even if not officially on duty, I encourage to visit Tinsi's hospitals and assist wherever possible. Every effort counts in preventing further loss of life and ensuring that all patients receive the care they urgently need. The Inspector General of Police, IGP Kayode Adeolu Egbetokun has on behalf of the Nigeria Police Force, commiserates with the government and good people of Jigawa State, most especially the families of victims of the tanker explosion which occurred at about 11.30 p.m. on October 15, 2024, in Majia. Tora local government area of Jigawa State claiming several lives and leaving many injured. The calamitous incident reportedly claimed the lives of over 100 people, while over 70 persons were seriously injured and are currently receiving treatment at various hospitals in the state. Also, the IGP commends the efforts of the police personnel and other emergency responders for their swift action in extinguishing the fire evacuating the victims, and ensuring normalcy is swiftly restored in the area. The IGP, while praying for the souls of the departed ones, reassures the general public of robust sensitization programs on the hazardous effects of oil scooping and other similar activities. He equally urges motorists and road users to always exercise caution and adhere to lay down safety guidelines in their daily conduct. The first public relations officer, Olumuiwa Adejobi said in a statement on Thursday. Kano State Governor Abba Kabi Yusuf visited Jigawa State and donated 100 million nairas to help the victims of the incident. In a statement issued on Thursday, he said, alongside the Deputy Governor, His Excellency Aminu Abdusalam, I led a high-powered delegation from the Kano State Government to condone with the government and people of Jigawa State over the recent fire disaster in Magia, Tora local government area. While extending our sympathies to Governor Umar Namadi Danwadi at the government house in Dutse on Thursday, I also announced a donation of 100 million naira from the Kano State Government to the victims of the incident. The donation is meant to provide relief to the families of those who lost their lives and to support the treatment of those injured in the fire. We once again extend our heartfelt condolences to the bereaved families and offer strength to those recovering from injuries. May the Almighty Allah grant relief to all in need. Sazuwa Kong Nebel, bring the news in a more digital way.